Today we give you six cool things you can do with food coloring. Number six, before we show you what you can do with food coloring, let's make our very own. Place out a bowl with a piece of kitchen paper and put some raspberries in the bowl. Now squash the raspberries in the kitchen paper with a spoon and then squeeze out the juice. You can now color desserts like porridge. Pretty cool, right? And number five, if you find normal spaghetti too boring, why not pimp it up with food coloring? Fill the spaghetti in sealable bags like this and add the wanted color. Now close the bag so that there's some air left and then shake, shake, shake it. That's how to make eating pasta even more fun. Number four, color some water blue with food coloring. Fill the water in some ice cube forms and freeze it. Once the ice cubes are done, color some water yellow and fill it in glasses. Now add the blue ice cubes. Looks quite freaky, no? And once the ice cubes start melting, the colours will mix and your drink is green. Let's continue with number three. Take a bottle of plant oil and pour out a bit of it. Colour some water and pour it into the bottle with plant oil. As we all know, fat swims on top and water sinks. Now let's add a fizzy tablet and we'll get an effect similar to a lava lamp. It even looks great in the dark. Number two, mix these ingredients together for waffle dough and then stir it up with a mixer. Now divide the waffle dough onto three bowls, for example, and color it with food coloring. Whilst your waffles bake, put some food coloring in a bowl again and then add some cream. Whip the cream now and then serve it with colorful waffles on a plate. The result can't be overlooked. And here we are at today's number one. Now let's make some colorful chocolate popcorn. Melt some white chocolate and then color it with food coloring. Add some popcorn to the chocolate, mix it a little, and then place it on some baking paper to harden. After about 20 minutes in the fridge, your chocolate popcorn is done. So guys, if you enjoyed this video, give us the thumbs up. Now you can watch six cool things you can do with paper. To watch, just click here in the middle of the video. That's it for today. See you next time. Bye.